Technically, today's card is not a debit card, but it does link up to a debit card and also has cash back. Or should I say gas back? It's called the Pay With Gas Buddy card. And I got it not just because I want to review it, but because I drive more than 100 miles on a normal work day. That's way too much gas that I have to purchase, so I'm up to save money any way that I can. And in this inflation-fueled economy, <laughs> fueled, I want to share ways that you can save some cash for other budgetary necessities like groceries and chocolate milk. Gas Buddy card coming up. Hello there, I'm Caleb. If this is your first time here and you want to learn more about tips and tricks for saving money, then start now by hitting the subscribe button so you don't miss out on anything. And hit the like button for Hazelnut Coffee. People who are familiar with driving are probably familiar with Gas Buddy, an app that uses the power of a network of drivers and puts them to work reporting fuel prices at gas stations across the country. Maybe across the world, I don't actually know. It's a great app because you can easily look at your area and find the cheapest fuel prices. Well, they stepped it up a notch with a Pay With Gas Buddy card. It's not actually a debit card, but it operates the same way. When you sign up, you actually connect it to your checking account, and then when you hit the gas station, hit the gas station? Sounds like you're robbing them. Then when you go to the gas station, all you have to do is swipe your Gas Buddy card and fill up. Later, you get an email with a statement showing how much gas you got, how much it costs, and how much you saved using the Gas Buddy card. Then about two to four days later, the funds are withdrawn from your checking account. Speaking of savings, that's the whole point of using this card is for the savings it'll provide. There are two major memberships offered through Gas Buddy. One is free, another one is paid. We'll look at the free one first. The free membership provides a discount of up to 25 cents per gallon, depending on the gas station. In my case, I filled up the other night using the Gas Buddy card and saved 15 cents per gallon. That was before I upgraded to the paid membership. And that discount is on top of the three cent per gallon discount that I normally get at Speedway. Gas Buddy also has deal alerts within their app. When you open it up and look at a map, you can see all the nearby gas stations that offer a deal on their fuel. As an example, there's a marathon near me that's showing a 10 cent per gallon discount when you use the Gas Buddy card. The only caveat is that you have to activate the deal in the app before you go to the gas station. And it has to be used within four hours of activating the deal in the app. Now, when it comes to the premium subscription, let me lay it out for you. The premium membership costs $9.99 per month, and it'll get you all the way up to 40 cents off per gallon with deal alerts. The nice thing is you'll at a minimum receive 20 cents off per gallon for the first 50 gallons that you pump during the month, which will straight up cover your membership because 50 gallons times 20 cents per gallon equals $10. After the first 50 gallons, you'll earn at least five cents off per gallon, but it comes with one extra benefit roadside assistance. Now you can get roadside assistance with almost anything nowadays. It used to be only AAA, but now you can get it with gas buddy, your insurance, a tire purchase. I got roadside assistance with the purchase of a taco the other day. That's a lie. But seriously, AAA isn't the only place to get this service nowadays. And this service is nice because the savings on the fuel literally pays for the membership itself. Here's the thing, unless you plan to get it for the purpose of roadside assistance, this membership really is only good for people who drive a lot. Like me, I'll probably put 75 gallons in my car this month. That's a minimum total discount of $10 on the first 50 gallons of fuel and then at least $1.25 on the next 25 gallons. That's if you aren't going to gas stations that are offering deals. Well, if you aren't driving enough to use 50 gallons in a month, then maybe it doesn't make as much sense. It's definitely worth considering though. Now, before we get into the last few details about this card, we gotta thank our sponsor tires. I put 83,000 miles on my 60,000 mile tires, so I just got them replaced. And woo, check out that tread. Beautiful. And the nice thing is new tires should help with fuel economy so I don't have to fill up as much. So the question is, where is the pay with gas buddy card accepted? And the answer is almost everywhere, like 95% of gas stations in the United States. So is it worth it? It will be for me. It already paid for itself this month. Anything we can do to save some money in this inflation driven economy is a plus. I just did a video on inflation where I showed that in the United States, fuel prices are up an average of more than a dollar per gallon now over last year. <sighs> So is the paid membership worth it for you? No idea. Depends on how much you drive and if you need roadside assistance. The free version is for sure worth it at a minimum. So tell me down below what you're doing to save money on gas right now. I'd love to hear from you because I will take any tips that I can get. And hit the like button because that's the best way to let me know that you found this video helpful. Oh, and hit the subscribe button and notification bell. And remember, money doesn't have to be confusing. You can control it. If you'd like to see more ways to save money on everyday expenses, check out this video right here. And if you'd like to see a playlist all about rewards debit cards, then check out this playlist down here.